Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Alhamdulillahirrahmanirrahim. Wa bihi nasta'in. Wa ala umri dunia wa din. Wa salatu wassalamu ala asrafil anbiya wa mursalin. Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in amma. With all due, your respect to the Honorable, the principal of MFK Solo. The Honorable Alderis, as well as the dearest friends. First of all, let's say our praise and gratitude only to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala due to His grace and blessing upon us, so that on this good time and occasion, we all can still gather and display in the best of our heart. Secondly, let's deliver prayer and greeting to our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu who has brought us from the darkness to the brightness, so we are always in the right way. I stand here in order to deliver a message that I think it is so important for us to know. It is about the role of the young generation. Ladies, gentlemen, and all friends that I love. Youth is a figure that always brings alteration. Alteration in life, order of some era, is quite influenced by the role of the youth. In 1982, Youth gather all together and then took the place to tighten the unity of Indonesia. This pledge was known as Youth Pledge. All youth from all over Indonesia, from various ethnic, cultures, languages, and religious groups were retaking the independence of nation all together. Uniting with the pledge is actually intended for all elements of the nation. But for you, it is a must because it is in the hands of young people that Indonesia can be more advanced. You, for advanced Indonesia, are youth who have character, capacity, ability to innovate, high creativity, and able to survive in actual and efficient world competition. On one occasion, the first president of the Republic Indonesia Bung Karno won't say, do not inherit the ease of the youth world, but inherit the fire of the youth world. In one moment, but this is not the end. Who does know Mr. Sukarno, our first president of Indonesia? Nobody than him in each of his speech to encourage the youth in maintaining the independence of Indonesia. The long journey of Indonesia shows us how great the influence was regarding our nation's life. And then, as the young Muslim generation, what have we contributed to society, nation, religion, and especially our own self? Have we given any alteration? A Muslim youth so go on with positive alteration day after day in his or her life. How a loss of a Muslim youth is seen to be worse than yesterday? The success of youth in dealing with a number of handicaps alone with the good alteration will be the basic in how he or she brings alteration to his or her surroundings and thoughts that are bigger than that. Two out of my companions that I pulled up. Dealing the role of the youth, Imam Safi'i remain us. That the young today is the leader of the future. Subhanu Yawni Rijalu Mukhor. To bring the balanced physical alteration, youth also need to take into consider of three things that underlie spiritual alteration. First, youth need to have strong faith. Second, Youth need to be always easy comma in performing any religious services and that is. Third, youth have good manner or ahlak hasana. Ladies, gentlemen, and all the companions placed by Allah, it's about the time for Muslim youth to rise up for creating in every lane of life and keeping as well as in maintaining the self-image of Islam. Moreover, Islam has been being besieged from the direction. We need to increase our knowledge 
about Islam by reading various books, not only Islamic books, but also those books whose contents sometimes offense of the world of Islam. Thus, your generation can have profession to become the agent of alteration. Oh, Indonesian youth, the world is waiting for you. Fight, give birth to ideas, determination, and aspiration. Your sacrifices and struggles will never be in vain in changing the world. Make over yours as the time that's full of benefits and all the good things before the coming of old age. When out of our spirit will fade away. What are we waiting for? If we can do the alteration now, use our youth side to become the part of Islam's awakening history in Indonesia. That's all I could say. I wish we can meet again someday. Please forgive me for mistake on my work. Thank you for your attention. Bilahi Taufiq Walidaya. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.